The high profile Karen Reed murder trial opened this morning. I'm Kayla Fish and I'm Kim Kalunian. Reed is charged with second degree murder in the death of her boyfriend, Boston police officer John O'Keefe. Our Jake Holter is live in studio with a recap of what happened inside the courtroom today. Jake. Well, Kim and Kayla, the prosecution and defense laying out their arguments to the jury this morning before testimony got underway. The defense presenting Karen Reed as a woman framed. Karen Reed was framed for a murder she did not commit. The trial of Karen Reed officially underway Monday. Reed, the defendant in the January 2022 death of her boyfriend, Boston police officer John O'Keefe. Prosecutors say O'Keefe was found unresponsive in a snowbank outside of a Canton home. The only true and just verdict based on that is that the defendant, Karen Reed, is guilty of murder in the second degree, striking the, uh, the victim, Mr. O'Keefe, with a car, knocking him back onto the ground, striking his head on the ground, causing the bleeding in his brain, swelling, and then leaving him there for several hours in a blizzard. But the defense saying Reed is the victim of a cover-up by police as the home O'Keefe was found in front of was that of a fellow Boston police officer. The defense believes that O'Keefe was beaten inside the home, bitten by a dog, and left outside. You will question their shoddy and biased investigation, a faulty investigation that led to Karen Reed sitting here today. Well, the fact that this trial is even going forward is flabbergasting. Like, I, I don't understand. Demonstrators gathering outside the courthouse calling for Reed's freedom. This is truly uh, an innocent woman, you know, it's that's what it is. And, you know, uh, it could be any one of us. I think that's why a lot of us stand behind it, is that it could be any one of us. Now coming up on 12 News at 5, you'll hear testimony from O'Keefe's brother. Reed has pleaded not guilty to the charges, and the trial is expected to last six to eight weeks. Live in studio, Jake Holter, 12 News.